In this video, we'll talk about living a courageous life. You would have probably heard the expression, there's no courage without fear. And this is true because courage is when you have anxiety and worry looking right at you, but you choose to respond fearlessly. Courage is taking action despite the fear you feel. And this is why it's a faulty interpretation to equate courage with fearlessness. You'll be able to get what you want out of life, pursue your dreams, and take chances when you're courageous. You can learn to make the most out of every situation and exercise your courage muscles in many ways. If you want to feel more courageous in your life and you've been struggling with fear, benefits of courage, acting despite the fear that inevitably sets in, examining the risk and rewards, and thinking things through is what being courageous is about. And moving beyond your fears takes work. You'll be able to accomplish positive things in your life and respond appropriately to risk when you become more courageous. Courage allows you to believe in your abilities. It bolsters your self-confidence and dons you the power to pursue the things that are important to you. If you feel fearful, don't assume you're not courageous. And don't let this make you beat yourself up. In fact, you'll be able to slow down and evaluate risk properly when you feel fearful. And this is one of the good sides of fear. You'll be able to use a courageous-based response to replace your fear-based response when you brace up yourself to face your fears. And without further ado, here are more benefits of courage. You'll be able to increase your sense of happiness when you embrace courage and incorporate it into your life. You stand a good chance of seizing opportunities as they present themselves. And you're more likely to pursue your dreams and become a more successful person when you're courageous. You'll be able to broaden the experiences you have in your life. And you'll be a better rounded person when you choose to be more courageous by stepping out of your comfort zone. When you're courageous, you'll serve as a motivation to others to be courageous too. You'll be able to see the world from a different perspective when you embrace courage. If you've always suffered from low self-confidence, find your courage and your self-confidence will grow. Ways to live a more courageous life. Number one, embrace vulnerability. Open up and become more vulnerable if you're scared of people seeing you for who you are. You'll have little or no confidence in yourself if you live a fear-based life, and this is why you must embrace vulnerability. Number two, admit you have fears. As I said, no one is born courageous. And for you to overcome your fears and insecurities, you need to get all the information you need about them. And before you can get this information, you have to first identify what you're afraid of. You must admit you have fears just as you open yourself up to others. Number three, face your fears. A great way to overcome your fears or phobia is by exposing yourself to your fears. For instance, if you have a phobia for cats, making friends with someone who has a cute cat can make you stop being afraid of cats and see things from a different angle. Number four, think positively. Stop paying too much attention to what could go wrong whenever you want to do anything. More so, let others love you and show you affection. This is also part of a positive attitude. Do you know this phrase they call hard guy when you act like you don't care about people loving you? Don't let that be your thing. Love people unashamedly and allow others to do nice things for you if you're someone who refuses favors. Five, reduce your stress. We all need a break. Take your vacation time, take breaks, exercise, get enough sleep, and make sure you eat well. At times, it's the exhaustion that makes you experience fear, and it's high time you start prioritizing your health and engage in activities or whatever helps you to de-stress. Six, demonstrate courage. Some people say they love to fake it until they make it, and others interpret that act as a demonstration. So demonstrate courage whenever you get a chance. Take a bold step to intervene or call for help if you see someone in distress. Instead of ignoring someone in a dangerous situation, think of what you can do to help. Showing your courage is a great way to overcome fear. Number seven, no failure but press forward. Keep moving forward instead of curling up into a ball when you fail. Fail forward and let all your failures keep propelling you to the next level or next stage. The more you fail, the more experience you have. Failure isn't that bad, but it can be very devastating and dangerous when you let it get to you. Number eight, cope with risk and uncertainty. Nothing is promised or 100% certain in this life, and learning to deal with life's uncertainties is a great way to conquer your fears. Figure out what you can do to keep your client or spouse if you fear you're going to lose them to another person. Likewise, you can set up an emergency savings account if you fear you'll lose your house to foreclosure. Number nine, continue to learn. Never stop learning. Whatever opportunities you see to learn a new skill or to further improve your skills, make sure you take them. Improve your skills, learn, and continue to grow. 
There will be less risk for you to take to become successful when you know more. And make sure you read all that you can regarding your industry. You should also read top thought leaders' books. Number 10, accept your challenges. This is where being responsible sets in. Accept your challenges. Do you even know that in most cases, fear is just in your head? Brace up yourself to face what lies ahead rather than hide. Even after you've confronted your fears and challenges, get yourself together to stay on the course. Remember that you can always get ahead by living, and wasting time worrying will do you no good at all. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.